Hello, YouTube community. How's everyone? Hope everyone's doing great um, here and um, just trying to be productive. <laughs> um, but there was a video um, that Belanda Holbert, I hope I'm saying your name right, did. And you guys know I'm talking daylight and dollar short on the reborn tag. Um, but she did it on what was your first thoughts? Um, what did you think when you first saw your first newborn? You know, for the first time. And it's crazy because, you know, as an aspiring artist, you know, I make them now. And, um, and as someone who, who's had them, um, you know, people give them to me, whatever, whatever, um, I, um, you know, was blessed to have some good friends. <laughs> But I, um, you know, my thing is when I, you know, it's kind of a great part of conversation because I you kind of get used to them. You get used to seeing what they look like. Hi, aunties and uncles. And you don't think twice about the way they look. It's only if I volunteer like at a senior home and I see people's responses or, you know, while I'm volunteering, if I have to stop at a department store or go for groceries and I bring them in with me. Then you see people's responses, and it reminds you, oh, okay, you know, this is what people are saying. Because you get used to seeing them. Yeah, people just get used to seeing us all the time. So we get used to seeing them, and we just don't think twice about it for the most part anymore, of how, you know, special and unique they really and truly are, which is kind of used to it, so to speak. Um, so that's a great conversation, Holanda, to start. And crazy, I actually have one of the this is that I had actually got from her, and she's doing very good, Miss Alanda. So thank you for, um, uh, you know, being such a great parent with her and then letting me get the chance to adopt her. And she's doing awesome. Um, this one is another baby. Um, this made by Yogi, um, uh, Yolanda, or Yogi, as some people may say, um, as well. So the one I got from Yolanda was the Yogi baby. And I just fall in love with her work. Yolanda's work is awesome. Um, so anyways, um, I was going to change her. and Hopefully I can keep on topic while I change her. She's pretty big. She is actually more a size. Hey, hi, she's adorable. She's more of a size, I would say, of a three-month-old baby. She's not a small infant. She's very tall and she's big at the same time. I would say she's more close to a three-month-old size. She's definitely not, you know, maybe newborn or anything like that. But, you know, I love bigger babies, to be honest. The baby, if they're a smaller baby, they have to be just scrumptious for me to say I really want a smaller baby. But most of the time, I prefer toddlers or, you know, some babies with some size and weight. Substance, I like to say, too. <laughs> And um, she's just like that great size baby. Yeah, look at the details on the painting. And, um, the sliding isn't the best. She's not showing up as well as pretty as she is in person. So you get the idea. She's very nice baby. Um, okay, so again, I'm getting where I was trying to take this conversation. So, yeah, so basically. Um, Guys know me, if I change clothes, I can't do what at the same time? I can't talk at the same time for my subscribers who've been with me. Um, you know, I, I just tend to babble a little bit when I change clothes, or I'll lose topics, so I apologize. Sorry. And it seems to happen to me again only when I'm changing clothes. Other stuff I can kind of, I'm a great multitasker. I can do it, but for some reason changing baby clothes seems to be okay. So, hello, look at me, look at me, look at me, aunties, hi, <laughs> and um, just really big legs, big old chunky chops, and just, hi, big old, big old, let me turn this way, here we go, so you can see the camera, big old, big old chunky legs and everything that I just adore great weight, head full of hair, just a lot of hair that I love. I'm the hair queen, I love it. Um, 
and just a And chocolate eyes is a big, huge puppy dog. I call them puppy dog chocolate eyes. They, when, I, when I look at her, it's like, oh, mommy, please pick me up. And, you know, I could have a lot of other work I'm trying to work on, but I just look at her and those big eyes, and it's like, they're. I always feel like they're imploring me. Please, mommy, pick me up, please. <laughs> but, um, so, any silly. So, Basically, what did I think? Um, my first reborn, I actually saw one in a store, and I thought it was real. I thought it was a real infant. And um, come to find out, when I approached the woman, she explained to me it was a doll. And I was shocked. I was shocked because the realism was in the artwork on that doll was just amazing. And I love art. I have uh, just, I love pictures. I will, I'm the type of person, I love the Victorian decor, and it's basically where you'll have a wall, and there'll be like 50 to 100 pictures and paintings all on that one wall. I love pictures. I love artwork of all types. Um, and so to me, seeing it, it's like, oh, this is like a work of art. This is unbelievable. It's like huggable art. That's what I call it, huggable art. And um, so unlike a picture where you can look at it and admire it, you can even touch it, yeah. But this, you can actually hug, hold, cuddle. It's art in 3D. And um, so I was just amazed. She told me the price she paid, and I will just say this, it was in 2000 on her particular baby. And I was like, wow, you know, that's, <laughs> you know, um, if we're well done baby, that's, you know, people will pay that, you know, but I, very budget friendly, budget conscious, and I um, don't spend a bad penny, I try not to. Um, wow, that's, that's a lot. <laughs> but the doll was so beautiful, and um, so, anyways, um, some years ago, I, I did, after meeting her, I did my research, and, um, I went to eBay, and really that was my first big eBay like experience. Um, I think it's such a word, eBay. Um, but, um, and that's where I actually went there and started looking for these lifelike dolls. And um, because I had always collected dolls anyway, I mean, I had everything from, you know, these old timey dolls to you know, modern uh, type dolls. And, Know, I you know, fallen in love with them. But these were different. These were very different from what I was used to seeing. And um, and then I found my first one. She was a toddler, one year old kitten skull, and absolutely beautiful. And when I got her, she was um, just as beautiful to me uh, in her pictures as she was. Person. And I was amazed when I saw her and opened her up, how big she was. I mean, she really was, you know, a lot of times if you buy dolls and such, they're not, or she's going to pull all their hair, hair bows and stuff out, trying to see if it's going to ring her hair. And you guys know, I'm not good at doing hair, so that disclaimer, it may cost me my mommy card, but there we go. <laughs> but, um, so, uh, basically, what happens was, I ordered it, it came, it was just as beautiful as I, I saw the picture, but I was just weird about the veins, and I was thinking, oh, these veins looked kind of thick, you know, from, from what I thought in my limited experience, and so I said, hmm, wonder if I can, you know, see what I can do, and try my hand with this, and that's, you know, when I first, um, I ordered my first sculpt, and, um, you know, tried and of course it's horrible and you know, throw it in the, in, the, in the trash or throw it, I ended up throwing it in the closet. <laughs> and I was like, oh my God, this is horrible. But, um, but yeah, but my first look at them was like, wow, I was just fascinated. I mean, it was just like something that came to life, you know? And that's the beauty of this art. It's like, 
sorry, <laughs> is that it looks like they, they've come to life. I mean, it's just this beautiful, beautiful artwork. Um, but I had collected, let me just show you someone, say hi. This is a Ashton Drake. Um, she's actually a silicone Ashton Drake. And um, is that right now for our kids here? But, so I had, you know, different types of, of uh, you know, everybody's pretty much heard, I believe, in the doll world. Hey, ah! 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 <laughs> uh, but basically, let me just grab See, she'll scare you guys for a second. Sorry about that. <laughs> oh, boy. To tame this, but um, yeah, so basically, what was going on is I fell in love, I fell in love, and, and, and it's like this I think because they're all so different and they're handmade, and each artist is going to put her stamp on that baby and make it hers, her art. It you can never get you will never get tired of looking at all the different ones, you know, and that's how I am, you know. I closer. I, sorry, <laughs> I never get tired, you know, of looking at them and of uh, collecting. But yeah, so that's, I got a little long-winded, so hopefully this doesn't cut me off. But that's my take on what I thought when I saw my first one. All right, have a great day, everyone. I say bye-bye. Sorry, I scared you with my bad hair. Talk with you later.